own personal performance, the save from the save from Zahor in the second half. How uh, how pleased were you with that? And you've kind of had to hit the ground running tonight. Yeah, very much so. I knew it was going to be difficult coming back in. Conditions for a goalkeeper weren't weren't the best, but I say I train I'm our socks off day in day out, ready for for an opportunity. And uh, however that may be, uh, I think Jamal's been been excellent uh, over the last month. So obviously there's a lot of pressure coming in tonight, but. Uh, considering I haven't played for a while, thought thought I'd done okay, and say I'm just really disappointed with the result. But I'll be ready to go again Saturday, and uh, it's a big push now, really, really big push. You, you've swapped around due to due to suspensions, and he took the mantle on after after the uh, the Bristol City game. Do you view this as your opportunity now to finish the season? Yeah, definitely. I think uh, at the end of the day, we both want to be playing, and I think we've had a, a really good battle this season. I think we see it in training day in day out. We both both work really hard, as well as Eastie as well, who has come on leaps and bounds this season. And I always say it, but it's credit to Wardy that what he does, he puts in so much work and, and the attention to detail that he puts in gives us the opportunity to to perform at our best uh, out on the pitch. And I say personally, it has been a bit frustrating compared to sort of the highs of last year of being in the team of the year and playing every game. But again, it's the championship. We stepped up another level, and I expected a. Uh, a tough competition from Jamal and, and he's given me that and whoever plays between now and the end of the season will we'll support one another and, and do the best for the football club.